Making ink might be more complicated than you think. First, you're gonna need a pigment, which for a lot of history came from candles. Light a candle, let it warm up, and then hold a spoon over the smoke, and you'll notice it's gonna start picking up some carbon residue. Traditional ink factories in Japan will have like hundreds of oil lamps burning around the clock for the purpose of harvesting this soot. And once you have enough pigment, you'll want to add a splash of water, but make sure it's distilled water or, you know, you might end up growing mold on the page. And then you're going to need some kind of thickening agent. The most common one is gum arabic, which is the hardened sap from the acacia tree. You strip off bits of bark and then wait for these giant golden beads to exude. The sap will dissolve pretty easily in water and it gives it that consistency you need for it to stick to the page, but you may need to play around with the ratios a little bit or even add a splash of vodka to lower the surface tension to get the page to soak up the ink rather than just have it sit as a bead on top.